Today on the Candy Isle, Airheads Go Canadian. Hey, hey everyone, welcome to another review. My name is Jeff, and today we're reviewing Airheads Maple. That is right. Airheads is a uh, Parfetti, Parfetti Van Mel um, product that uh, is made, I think it's prime, what is Parfetti Van Mel? What are they, Dutch maybe? I think they're made all over the place. But um, in Canada, Parfetti Van Mel makes this one exclusive flavor. Product of the United States, yeah, but... Mm -hmm. Here it is. Uh, I think they're done out of the Allen Candy Company factory, maybe? They're in, it's in Mississauga, Ontario, which is like, um, it's another city, but it's just outside of Toronto. Um, uh, authentically flavored, artificial, sorry, authentically. <laughs> Come on, guys. Artificially flavored candy. Anyway, um, I looked on their website. I think that this is the only uh, exclusive regional version of Airheads. And this is a Canadian exclusive. Um, yep, nut free. Anyway, Airheads, if you uh, don't know, there's a nutrition facts and uh, your ingredient list. Airheads is a, uh, you know, it's a, it's a fruit strip, fruit chew kind of candy. Um, and, oh boy. Man, this just looks like a... Log of caramel almost. Or it's not maple. It looks like a log of maple. <laughs> um, but I think it's the standard Airhead stuff, which is normally like a fruit flavor, right? But this one... What the? This isn't... That does not smell right. It smells like... It doesn't smell great, guys. I gotta say. I was expecting something to smell really good, like super mapley. This is like, uh, it smells like, I don't know, like cardboard maybe? <laughs> it's not good. I can't put my finger on it exactly. It's not cardboard, but it's something <laughs> that's like, it's not like repulsive, but it's like, like wood. It smells like a tree. <laughs> it's not a maple tree. <laughs> I don't know what this smells like, guys. It doesn't smell great, I gotta say. <laughs> maple trees don't really smell, just so you know. <laughs> I don't know why you wouldn't know that, but I guess maybe you don't have maple trees where you live. I've got, you know, living in Canada, I have a lot of maple trees. I've got, I got a maple tree in my, in my front yard, in fact. Not a sugar maple, but, you know. Um, they don't really smell. This, this does not smell great. So normally this is like a fruit strip kind of product, right? I think it's about this thick, maybe a little less. It doesn't feel, this feels like way denser. This is like a like a log though, right? Maybe it's been a minute since I've had Airheads, but like, this is a weird version of it. This is very weird. Is it, do you think this is like unique? A unique version? Cause it's like, it's just like, let's add maple sugar to it. I'm gonna try this. What? What is that? Oh. Oh. What is that? Oh. Guys, it's got like a... You know how, you know how like a, like a fruit chew, like a fruit strip is what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about? Like a fruit strip, right? That's what airheads normally are. This is not, this is not that at all. I mean, I'm sure it's made by the same people, but like, at first I was like, it's not gonna come off. And then I was like, maybe I didn't, you get the right temperature, you know? Look, strip fruit, candy, whatever, you, you, soft candies, you gotta have them at the right temperature. Figuring out what that is, depending on what the candy is, is not always the easiest thing. But that's not the case. Because it, then it sort of crumbled off and, I wonder if this actually has maple sugar in it it's got this like you know the way brown sugar it's very sticky you know the way brown sugar dissolves um it's like clumped and then it just dissolves this has a little bit of that like a little bit of the um it's a maple candy anyone in canada will have had the maple candies you know maple sugar candies <clears throat> excuse me 
I totally reviewed them here on the channel. They're like basic, they're literally just maple sugar. Um, they make them into little maple, maple leaf shaped candies. I think this, the, I think this tastes crazy and weird and not good because it does not taste good guys because it's, um, I think it's got real maple in it. No, maybe not. Uh, sugar, corn syrup, ma ma I don't know, ma I don't know what that is. Dextrose, modified corn, modified food starch, corn. Partially hydrogenated, hydrogenated so it was a soybean oil, palm oil, palm oil, Ugh. water and artificial flavors and colors. <sighs> Soy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Doesn't, doesn't have maple in it. Doesn't have real maple in it, I guess. Unless sugars means maple sugar. But, uh, ooh, this is weird and not good. It doesn't smell right. And the texture is not, the texture is like, it's like hard. And then it, but then it kind of dissolves. Uh, I think I just, I, I, I don't, I don't think I want to have any more of this. Um, look guys, I like airheads. Don't get me wrong. I, I'm a fan of airheads. I don't, I don't, I don't think this is, I don't think this is good. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think this, uh, I don't think this meets the quality standards of uh, normal fruit flavored airheads. And, uh, uh, you know, as patriotic as I can be, I, uh, I cannot, I cannot uh, endorse this, this thing. Absolutely not. <sighs> Sorry, airheads. This is a big, big old mess of a thing. This is, I, if you like this, you guys let me know down in the comments because I, I think it's disgusting. I think that's pretty gross. Um, yeah. Don't get this. Uh, Walking the Candy Isle rates Airheads Maple a big old zero out of, out of, out of five. It's, uh, you know, it's like, it's, uh, you know, it's not the, I guess it's not like the worst thing I've ever had. Uh, I think I reviewed that, that, that like banana bar that had like a, a, a piece of plastic in it or something. That was pretty bad. Um, this is like, you could eat this. You wouldn't, you wouldn't be sick. It doesn't taste like, like barf or anything. Like it's, you know, if you get those, you know, the, the birdie bots, any flavored beans, those, the, those have some pretty gross flavors in them. This isn't like that, but it's like, from what I thought this was going to be to what it actually is, this is like a world of difference. It's not even like, oh, it's not as great as I was hoping. This is like, it's, it's not good. Um, like I'm going to throw it out. So, uh, that's my take. Stay away. And, uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching. I gotta go. Uh, bye-bye. <laughs>